the reason I really am attracted to street photography is I, I like the chaos of it and I like the unplanned things that can happen you know, on the street that really appeals to me. When I'm shooting, what I look for is just interesting people. And Lower Broadway in Nashville is, is a gold mine because you can walk around the same two or three blocks and every time you come around, it's another thousand different people. And it's just the diversity of people. And you know, the thing that makes it magic down there to shoot street and easy to shoot street is you've got thousands of tourists coming here that are spending you know, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars a night on a hotel. They spent a month or two picking out their outfits. They're walking around, they're, they're in their own reality show and you point a camera at them and they're like, wow, I'm famous, <laughs> you know? So oddly enough, I've never had a negative reaction. I've never had anybody, please delete that, you know, which is kind of the kindest way they could, they could deal with it, but it's never happened because, you know, they want to be seen. I, I was lucky enough to have a really great photography teacher. Um, famous guy, Gary Winogrand, was my art teacher. And street photography in general cuts across a lot of different art movements, you know, Dada, surrealism, cubism. I mean, all, all those kinds of things will pop up in street photography. Abstraction, um, and especially, you know, shooting the, the uh, things through the window downtown, that's, you know, very much abstraction. Well, I started shooting the window reflections, like, from the beginning. Mainly because, if you know Lower Broadway in downtown, all the honky-tonks, the bands play in the window, in the front. You know, the action's all up front downtown, and the, you know, the players. And, and then you've got, you know, the signage in the background, and cars, and people, and reflect. I mean, it's just, you know, massive amounts of, of information in a frame that comes through those windows. And again, I like the abstraction of it. For aspiring, you know, photographers, just get out and start shooting. Find a little camera that's easy to, to use and, and, and go for it. This NPT Arts Break is made possible by the generous support of the Martha Rivers Ingram Advised Fund of the Community Foundation of Middle Tennessee.